I'm so serious. That's what I I don't I don't edit. I don't uh, edit. I push record just like this. Uh huh. So y'all see, I'm getting my nails done, <laughs> and I'm trying to see if I can get this person that's doing my nails to get into YouTube because he wants to start a YouTube channel, guys. So this is the person that actually did the cat eye. Say hi. Hi. There he is. Okay, everybody. I will see you guys later in the video. Stay tuned in. Okay. He is doing a fill on my nails and I have decided to go with is it the holograph style? So guys, it's gonna be blue and green. Stay tuned in to see that. All right, everybody. So this is what I'm getting, guys. Color right there. Very interesting. So it's more like a like an upgraded glitter, a holographic look. I love my nails, everybody, because they are beautiful, guys. Okay, here. Oh, you gotta put something up. You gotta finish this hand. Okay. Oh, you are really like it. And that is what they look like, everybody. Beautiful and sparkly. Cute. All right. We so now you're gonna be asking. Who did it? Love it. Just call me Sparkles. Just call me Sparkles. <laughs> <laughs> Say what? This is the person that actually did my nails and they look beautiful. Thank you. You're welcome. All right. This is what I went and got. Just a snack on. Y'all know when it's hot, you just don't feel like eating. Well, I don't. I feel like eating real heavy. So I just went and got a few things, y'all, from the store. Okay. Got me some strawberries. I love strawberries. The thing is, strawberries to me are never, and I do repeat, they're never sweet. They're never sweet, okay? So I got some of this to go with it, okay? And I really hope, I hope it make a difference. I'm sure it will though. Mango, grapefruit, those oranges, mandarin oranges. Ranch, love me some celery, love it. And my little snacking tomatoes right here. Okay, I don't know what to do though. I don't know if I'm gonna eat some of this. I think I wanna eat this. And the sub from Subway. <laughs> this is spicy Italian sub, y'all. I don't know which one to do. Oh, and I got me some cookies too. Some yummy cookies, y'all. Gourmet all butter southern pecan cookies. <laughs> excited about that and then I got some milk okay I don't know what I'm gonna do I might do it all I don't know stay tuned in to find out no this lingerie something serious y'all Woo! A little peep shot yeah. Woo! <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo. it's hot like fire okay <laughs> no but I actually uh, did some only fans footage earlier though I had this on earlier before Ooh. I left the house today yeah I'm hot I'm in so peace I'm so I'm so hot y'all I can't even Ooh. let me show y'all what I got and I'm gonna hold it up so y'all can see okay now these are those snacking tomatoes they're super good got some strawberries and one piece of celery okay all right, and I'm my oranges, which I'm gonna get started on right now. Damn, so good. I'm, 
I'm hot, y'all. Alcohol. Shit. You know how to cool off. Shit, spray your stuff up. The fan hit it. You'll be all right. Say number alcohol. I'll be okay with this. Shit. Oh, Lord, have mercy. You talk about cooling off instantly? This is the way to do it. Keep me cool for the rest of the video. Sure, right? The fan right on me. Ooh, yes. I hate being hot. All right, now, I am going to try this glaze. This is the Marzetti brand, and I can't wait to try this, y'all. Now, you can put this on desserts, like cheesecake and stuff. That's what it looking like. Jello. Smell good. Strawberries. Okay. Here we go. Let's try it. Oh, y'all ever. It's thick. Damn. It's thick. I never tried this. Let me know if y'all tried it before. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's what you need for all strawberries to me because no strawberries. Well, one time in my life, y'all, one. I had one sweet strawberry in my life. I think I might have even talked about it. And that was at the Hilton in Chicago on Michigan Avenue. Mm-hmm. Then again, y'all, this shit is too thick. It's good, but it's too thick. It's thick. Damn. Look how thick that is. That is thick, honey. Move, kitty. You was not finna get none, cat. Mmm. That's all right, you know. I mean, I think it's good because it's gonna make any strawberry sweeter than it already is strawberries are not sweet but this is some thick stuff that's thick oh shit and i messed around and got light oh no i do damn i don't like nothing light but i'm gonna eat it kind of watery i'm good bro. Mm. Ah, like that. Strawberry stuff everywhere. So anyway, y'all. Move. Warmy down here. Move! Girl! Get out of here! And people can see you, kitty. And you being naughty. Just get you some food. Now, what do you want to sit over here? They run back and forth on me. That hair moving around and stuff. Sit down. Now I like this. I, this is light. I know you don't buy anything light, but this is good. Mm -hmm. I like it. I was going to eat that uh, spicy Italian sub, but you know what? I may as well just have it another day. Okay. I want to talk about something else today. And that something else is men. Okay? I'm going to ask a hypothetical question, whatever. Y'all answer. Let me know what y'all think, okay? Let me fix this back. 
understand. He is wet too. Woo! Saturated. Saturated. Definitely saturated. But anyway, that's what I want to say. Have you ladies ever had a man that you kind of was not sure if he was uh okay let me say this okay if you start to date someone just say for instance you meet somebody whatever whatever and you start to go out with this person start dating this person okay it's cool and over time this man shows you that he's there for you like come on warmy Woo. but anyway the man shows you that he's there for you meaning that he is i mean if it's financial emotional um just for support somebody to talk to just just there for you and i'm gonna just sum it up and say in every way okay if you have a man like that but you just even though he showed you multiple times that he would ride for you or whatever what if you just still wasn't sure about this person <laughs> i mean i know i have trust issues okay i i'm not when it comes to the opposite sex now especially okay especially but i gotta question myself sometimes because there's someone around, and this person has been really sweet all the time. I'm going to be honest. He's sweet all the time. I mean, from the time he get up to the time he go to bed, you know. I mean, just the communication. I mean, everything's there, okay? But I still just <laughs> feel like... uh you know, like, I still need to be giving this person a side eye, like, you know. And I think that's the, I don't know, y'all. Sometimes I feel bad. I feel guilty, you know, because I'm like, damn, you know, this person is always doing the right thing. Why don't I just, just trust this person? But what if that person had given you just one reason, one reason only, not to trust them, and stepped out? And actually cheated, okay. Hmm. So I I think that that might add a twist to the story, or at least it, it just might add a twist. And I say that because you meet somebody, y'all getting along, everything's cool. I should have said, and y'all actually get together as a couple, everything's cool, everything's good. And then uh, infidelity happens, okay? But I'm going to say this, just to be fair. Say it happened on both parts. Both parts, okay? So, what do you do with a relationship like that? Do you think that, realistically, there's some hope there? Because you know, even though this person has been there and this stuff, it only take one time, y'all, one to have an infidelity and I'm just saying that person can you know you can try to say okay well we're gonna move forward and try to not think about you know the bad stuff and just try to focus on being positive and moving forward and that person go back to showing you that he can be there okay that he can be your support system, whatever. He go back to showing you all the stuff that you know and all the stuff, things that you liked about him in the very beginning. He go back to showing you all of that even though he cheated. How would you feel? What would you do? Would you take him back? Um, I need some feedback, ladies. Some real feedback, okay? So let me know what, what y'all would do. And maybe, you know, I apologize for not explaining the story the right way. Because now maybe it makes sense as to why the trust wasn't there, you know? Maybe it'll make sense now. So, like I said, 
put yourself in that situation where you meet somebody, get in a relationship and go real quick through this again, summing it up. Get in a relationship, woo woo, everything working out, cool, 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 okay? Then the motherfucker cheat, okay? You do too, both. But still, do you really think it's hope for a relationship like that? Realistically, I mean, realistically, because aren't you gonna always be thinking, well, this motherfucker then did this or this motherfucker then did that? You gonna be thinking that. Period. You know. I mean, you can be the most mild-mannered person and be like, okay, we are going to work this out. We gonna get through this. I know we can do it. And you might agree, okay? But, uh, you gonna have reservations <laughs> about ever really trusting that person again. I would. You know. So, let me know if you, what, what would you ladies do? Would you go ahead and, and try to give this person another chance and, you know, try to work things out and try to see if, okay, he cheated before, but we got things back on track. I really believe this man is trying, you know, to move for. I really believe this man is trying to spend the rest of his life with me. So, he's saying, okay. Even though there was an infidelity, I can clearly see this man trying. I mean, doing all type of stuff. Everything for me. Everything. Every, literally, everything, okay? So, what would y'all do? Would you take that person back and try to work it out? Or would you just say, listen, this shit ain't gonna work. I don't trust you. You may not trust me. We both guilty of infidelities. It is what it is. Let's move around. We've been there, done that. Let's go ahead and, and do something else. Or would you do that? Would you take that type of, uh, you know, um, outlook on it? Okay. Anyway, y'all, I didn't eat none of my damn tomatoes. Let me eat some of my tomatoes. Got to talking. But yeah, y'all, that's, that's, a, that's a real touchy topic. Oh, yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Sweet snacking potatoes, just like they said. Sweet. Mm. Damn. Mm. Mm. They're good. They're good. But yeah, y'all. Okay. Does this make a difference? If you was married to that person and y'all had kids and stuff and he cheated, or both y'all cheated and got back together, would that make a difference if y'all was married because y'all have been through a whole bunch of stuff together and all that? And see, you just be like, okay, we'd have been through the, the, the whatever, the good, bad, up and down, we'd have been through it all. So we gonna stick together and ride this shit out, okay? Would you take that type of attitude on or would be like, Hey, man, I don't trust you. I can't do this. What would you do? This cat. Mm. Keep tripping. I'm getting out of here, kitty. Kitty. What would you do, kitty? Now, what would you do? Tell me, Wormy. If you had... Is this a female? If you had a boyfriend, a boy kitty, what would you do, kitty? Now, you done listened to me, cat, and you done heard me. What would you do? You gonna tell me? And what would you do, baby girl? He's baby. He's pretty. Oh, what would you do, kitty? He's pretty. <laughs> Kitty just told me she would let that cat kick rocks, y'all, and move around. <laughs> That's what Kitty said, y'all. <laughs> anyway. Ooh, she's pretty. Ooh, look at you. I love my cat. Anyway, ladies, I want some feedback on this video, uh, on the things I talked about. I, I really want, and I know y'all going to give me, you know, the, what you really 
what do y'all need to give me y'all serious real genuine feedback because that's what i want so okay guys let me go get this video ready and uh um, i'll probably see y'all tomorrow bye everybody <laughs> that ain't what i'm looking for